Hey guys, so this is going to be a Dollar Tree haul. I went to my local Dollar Tree to see what I could find to add to Robert, Kaylee, and Jordan's Easter baskets. I like to go for like holidays to Dollar Tree always first and then whatever I can't find or whatever I need, then I go to like Walmart, Target, Amazon, etc. Um, I actually looked for like Easter grass filler on Walmart, their website first. I don't know about like in-store pickup, but for shipping, it was like kind of expensive. I was like, yeah, that's not happening. So I actually got um, two packs of this Easter grass at Dollar Tree. And I actually thought this was a clever idea. They put um, three different colors. I'm not saying that's like the first time anyone's done it, but I've never seen it at Dollar Tree. If they have, they've never had it at my local one. Um, so I figured two you know, would be enough for one basket each. I might actually swap the colors and do like two different colors in each basket. It's four ounces each of Easter grass for a buck 25 each. The next item, which I thought was like really, really cute. I don't know why nobody's thought of this. If they have, I've never seen it. It's a gift bag, but it's for a bouquet of flowers. It's like so cute. They had maybe four different colors and like prints and I'm going to Grammy and Papa's house for Easter dinner so I'm gonna get Grammy a bouquet of flowers and an Easter card and put them in that that's just so cute then I got this really pretty tumbler and by the way I got a new phone so it looks kind of different I feel like it's not as bright but it's actually a really nice phone so um, if this isn't bright enough for you guys, like next time I film, I can definitely add another light or something. But anyway, so orange would not normally be the color I would grab for. And it's not 100% showing up true to color on camera. But it's a really pretty like creamsicle color. And I only got one. I was like, you know what? Normally I'd probably get like three or four. I was like, Jessica, just get one. This is going to get put up for gift giving. It's like pretty heavy duty, nice tumbler. Then they had these glasses right here, and I thought these were really pretty. They're glass, not plastic. They had orange, blue, pink. I don't remember the other colors. Um, once again, I only got one. There was a lady in back of me. She literally grabbed every single one of this glass one. I was like, geez, what the heck is she going to do with those? But anyways, then I had gotten an Easter wreath, you guys, from Dollar Tree, and it was $3. It was the only item out of my whole shopping trip that was more than a buck 25. Well, I got these carrot lights to intertwine through the wreath. And then I got these little like um, kind of chunky glitter bunnies and chickies. And they have little clips on them. And I stuck them all over the wreath. And then I put the lights on it that light up at night. So there's that. And then I also got... Um, two packs of these and I hung a string and a pack of these is in the middle of the wreath. It actually looks really cute and it was super inexpensive. It looks like, I think it looks like a nice wreath that, you know, you would have spent more money on. So the next item that I got was this detangling comb with shower handle and I got this for Kaylee's Easter basket. They had these in like baby blue, um, this pretty pink, and I love baby blue, so I was really torn between the two, and I almost got both, but I was like, don't be wasteful, just get one, so I got this. Isn't that so cute? And they had a bunch of stuff to match this. They had little makeup brushes, these, the little scrubby gloves, like, just all different stuff. I was very tempted to just grab all of it, but I was like, no, just get the stuff you want. So I got this cute little bird, which I've gotten a bird like this before, or birds from Dollar Tree, but this is going to go in one of my best friend's birthday gift. I just thought that was really cute for spring and summer. Then this is one of the actual baskets I got. I probably didn't need any baskets from Dollar Tree, and the reason I only got one is because I know I have extra baskets, but I figured I better get one just in case, and... If I use this for Kaylee's Easter basket, all this cute little stuff I got her is going to look really cute in there. I already put it all in there and it looked so cute. I had actually ordered her a really cute Hello Kitty Easter basket off of Walmart like, I don't know, a month and a half ago. 
and it was in an Amazon or no a Walmart box and my son thought that it was empty so he crushed it and it got busted I was like no and I actually got it on clearance too I don't know why it was on clearance because Easter hadn't passed but yeah so then they had all these really cute Easter little like Christmas trees and look you guys they light up some of them light up and some of them don't I'm like if I had known that they uh were lighting up like this I definitely would have got more especially for a buck 25 I will definitely use these in my Christmas village next year next year is going to be the first year that I'm going to start a Christmas village and I do do the I do do I do do the baby pink um, Christmas stuff as well as like, you know, classic red and green. Then I got this glow up toner by, uh, Be Pure and this glow up serum. I guess these are dupes to like some popular brand. I, I don't know you guys, I'm 38 now. I used to be like so into makeup and I would keep up on all that stuff, but <laughs> I guess I'm just getting older. I don't know. This says with watermelon extract and hyaluronic acid. Um, so yeah, and they're glass bottles. They're not plastic. Then they only had one more of these or I would have gotten three for all three of their Easter baskets. I don't really like getting candy from Dollar Tree that's like not name brand. Anyone who buys off-brand candy from Dollar Tree, I'm, you know, I'm not knocking them, but especially the chocolate, we call it mocklet. I've never had any of it that tastes good. Like, it just tastes weird. But I'm like, well, it's cotton candy. It's so cute. There's blue raspberry, cotton candy, and watermelon. So this one's going to go in Kaylee's basket because she's a girl. So, I mean, I don't think those are... Oh, they're individually wrapped, so technically I could... Yeah, I could just take one out and put one in each of their baskets. Then I only got one thing of Peeps because I don't think uh, my son and Kaylee like Peeps. But I was like, I have to get a thing of Peeps. Like, they had blue, pink, yellow. They had the confetti, like, cake ones where it's white with all the colored sprinkles. I got this for Jordan's Easter basket. He appreciates a good Peep. And then I got... For Robert, the Kellogg's Rice Crispy Milk Chocolate Bunny. And he loves Rice Crispy Treats, so this was perfect. And like I said, everything else is about 25 I got Jordan, the Russell Stover. And then Kaylee, I got this one, and it's the Cookies and Cream. But I was like, oh my gosh, I had... Well, not that I had no idea, but I didn't pay attention. It's Frankfurt. I thought it was a Russell Stover one because... Sometimes they have the Russell Stover at Dollar Tree in the cookies and cream. So I'm like, oh my gosh, I hope it doesn't taste disgusting. Maybe because it's cookies and cream, it won't taste as bad as like an off-brand milk chocolate. So we'll see. There's those. Then I got them each a pack of this double bubble. Um, it's the egg-shaped bubble gum. Okay, you guys, I am completely guilty of getting into this. <laughs> I got two bags of this, and it's actually not bad. So it's the name brand um, Tootsie Roll, and it's the Fruit Chew. So it's got all the pastel colors, and oh my gosh, that's what I forgot. I know I have extra plastic Easter eggs, but they're like packed away. I can't find them, so I'm going to have to dig them out because I like to put... Even though Robert and Kaylee are older and Jordan's an adult, I still like to put some, like, plastic eggs in their Easter basket and, like, put little candies in it. It's just cute, you know? So I got those to put in some of the eggs. There's vanilla, lemon, lime, orange, and cherry. The vanilla one wasn't my favorite, but all the rest were really yummy. Then my son always liked... Um, the Three Musketeers, but now he's really into Snickers. He's not like a huge candy fan, so I got um, two of the little mini six-packs of Snickers, and then I got two of the mini five-packs of the Hershey's. I'll just split those up in between all of their Easter baskets. And then I got them each a Haribo Happy Hoppers um, gummy bear pack. That's another Snickers. That's another 
Caribou Happy Hoppers. Then I got two of these little Reese's Peanut Butter Eggs. And it's only 2.68 ounces. But I want to say there's maybe like, I don't know, nine, eight or nine little eggs in there. And I'm going to put those in little plastic eggs in their Easter baskets as well. Or just, you know, I'm not going to just put this in there. I'm going to open it. So with how expensive chocolate is nowadays, I mean, a buck 25 for that is not like the worst deal. It's maybe not the best, but it's not the worst. Here's another little Easter tree, and it's in kind of like a green, pastel green color. This one doesn't light up. Then they had these little tiny packs of these Easter trees, and these are also going to be for my little Christmas village. I looked at the little stuff, even on Amazon, just little trees like this, and even stuff like this is expensive. Like, even the plastic Christmas Village stuff is really expensive, so those will get put away. It would be really cute to put them around for Easter as well, but that's just not my intention for those. Then I just thought this little headband was so cute. I love the rainbow stuff. God's promise to never flood the earth again. And it's these like bright colors. So I actually had the idea to do the little like punch bowls. You guys have probably seen it many times where, you know, they stack the two punch bowls, like one up, one on top, and then a small one on top with the Easter, um, ears on top and then you put the two little feet and you put all the grass inside with the Easter goodies but a lot of the punch bowls were like gone there were some I could have done it but I just I don't know I didn't really like the colors they had that much plus I'm just lazy right now so then I got this really pretty card for one of my best friends um her birthday's coming up this was one of the dollar 25 cards or wait are the cards only a dollar or are they a dollar 25 because I know there's the two for one this wasn't a two for one so I'm not going to read the whole inside but it says thinking of you and wishing you a very happy birthday it's got these beautiful butterflies I thought that was fitting considering it's Easter and then that's what the inside looks like then I got this peace tea, just peachy for Jordan's Easter basket. He likes um, peace tea. Then for Kaylee's Easter basket at Dollar Tree, they had the little trees in the Sunset Beach. And I was like, oh, and the color is kind of like Eastery. So, and it smells good. So there's that. Kind of matches those bunny ears. Then I really wish I would have got two of this, you guys. It's glass. It's like a, is that a lotus? It's really heavy and you can't see it on here on camera, but it's got kind of like a rainbow iridescent look to it. It's really pretty. So I just thought with a, a tea light in that, it would be so pretty. Then I had showed this to you guys in the past. So this is the ice cream scoop I have right now. This is actually originally from Walmart. It's the Joey brand rainbow ice cream scoop. But my son and his girlfriend, um, they have, they've switched their jobs. They have a really good job right now. They work together again and they're saving for a house. So I decided to start doing like a trunk and getting them stuff little by little. Like I already ordered them an electric can opener off of Amazon. I ordered them like a really nice spoon set. So this is going to go in Kaylee's Easter basket. You know, just something to add to their trunk for their future home. And then I got Kaylee this little LA Colors Your One in a Melon. Isn't that so cute? But I don't know if I'm going to put it in her Easter basket because I ended up ordering her an EOS chapstick off of Amazon. It was only two bucks off of Amazon, so I don't want to put two chapsticks in there. Then they had these adorable socks, and these socks were near all of um, like this themed stuff, like probably for Mother's Day because this says Koala Mom on it. And then this one I got for Jordan's mom. It says Mama Bear. Because everyone calls her Mama Bear. Aren't those so cute? And they're like cozy socks. And they have the little rubber grips on the bottom. Then. I guess I could stop saying for Kaylee's Easter basket. Most of the stuff is for Easter baskets. I thought these colors were kind of Eastery. Like the pastel. It's got the Care Bears on it. So cute. 
They had these sassy and chic nail clippers, you know, like if you're doing acrylic nails, you can cut it. I thought that was a great deal for a buck 25. Then I got this loofah and I'm like, oh, that's going to be so cute. All these colors in Kaylee's basket just are going to look so cute with the kind of light baby bluish green basket and the pinks and the lavenders it's gonna be so cute and I have the rainbow stuff to go in there then they had these you guys which they've had at Dollar Tree before they had this baby blue with pink and purple and then they had ones where the background was baby pink and the cool thing is they had the mommy size and then they had like the mini size for like a little girl I thought that was so stinking cute so that's for Kaylee and then for myself, because I love rainbows and I love ankle socks, I got this pack with the little rainbows. I'm just in love with these ankle socks and I love Dollar Tree's ankle socks. And then to go in Robert's Easter basket for um, his item to go in the trunk for their house, I really wanted black. I, I did not want white at all, but they were completely out of black. So I'm like, they're just measuring cups. I got these, so those will go in their trunk as well for their future home. And then I think that's everything from Dollar Tree, but let me show you these super cute ankle socks I just got today for myself from Burlington Coat Factory, guys. They're so cute. So I love Winnie the Pooh. I love Dumbo. I actually used to collect Winnie the Pooh. So at Burlington Coat Factory, it was $6.99, and look how many socks you get. Tell me those are not so precious. They are so precious. There has to be something of Winnie, Pooh, Winnie the Pooh on the gray ones. or I guess those ones are just gray. These are the honeycomb. This one's polka dots. That one has Winnie the Pooh pots in his little face. Um, that one looks like it's just white. Oh my gosh, look at that one, you guys, with Winnie the Pooh. And it's like yellow and orange and then another polka dot and then this one where it says um hello oh hello honey they're so adorable i got other stuff from burlington coat factory but um i know this really isn't a burlington coat factory haul so i'll leave that stuff out i hope you guys have a beautiful and blessed easter spend it with the ones you love if you're by yourself, I still hope that you guys have a blessed Easter, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.